Well, sometimes there just isn't a solution that works for everybody. And that's the case for the Rapid City Board of Education, who will need to redraw district boundaries to prevent overcrowding in certain schools. Fred Walton spoke with the president of the school board and has more on why the district is looking at new boundaries. Rapid City schools have a problem. Some schools don't have enough students, others are overpopulated. A proposal to redraw district boundaries has some parents concerned, and the Board of Education president understands. We do listen, we do care, um, we do evalu um, um, evaluate their, their concerns and see if we can be accommodating in any way, and sometimes we just cannot and we just have to make the decision. The Board of Education makes decisions based on the needs of the entire district, and unfortunately, this means some students may need to change schools. Southwest Middle School is just one of Rapid City's public schools whose student populations would be altered following a proposed school district boundary change, which was addressed in Tuesday night's Board of Education meeting. Middle school students living east of Mount Rushmore Road, north of Catron Boulevard, and west of Fifth Street may need to transfer from Southwest to South Middle School. Concerned parents say they made housing choices based on the schools their children would attend. You know, some families are going to get caught in the middle and, and inconvenience. But again, even when that happens, we, we will do our best to try to work with those families and make the transition and the change of schools um, as least traumatic as, as we can. Tuesday night's meeting focused on clearly outlining which areas of Rapid City would be affected by a boundary change. Discussion will continue at upcoming public meetings. Reporting from Southwest Middle School in Rapid City, I'm Brad Walton.